Hey guys, 460 style here. Today, I'm gonna try to manage to stop a 38 Special Plus P. Today, I'm shooting a five gallon water jug. See right there, full water sideways. Um, we might not be able to retract the projectile because where I put it, there's a kind of a wasp nest there. <laughs> I had to run in everything to come here. Oh boy, but anyway, so we're shooting uh, 38 plus P, we're doing the white box, and these are at, let me see here, these are at 945 feet per second, uh, 248 foot pounds, at about, I don't know, about 15, 20 feet here, I'm on my knee, I'm on my knee, so I'm trying to get the best angle that I can, I was going to put it on that green bucket, but I can't now because of the wasp, <laughs> Uh, good time. All right, here we go. I'm gonna try it out and Hopefully I can stop the projectile uh, Tell me what you, what you think will the five gallon jug stop the projectile or will it go right through? Um, I Think it's gonna stop because water's pretty dense. I mean that's kind of a gimme, but Because uh, well, water doesn't compress for you people that, that don't know that water cannot compress uh, That's why you can't have water in your engine because the piston can't compress it and, and it just starts breaking metal. So that's how hard water is in a tight environment. But anyway, going off off the topic here. <laughs> All right, here we go. Uh, one shot. Turning it out of my torch tracker. My four inch barrel. So you guys would know the length of the barrel uh, for velocity. So. All right, here we go. Eyes and ears. You guys can see me here. One shot, one shot. Here we go. <laughs> I, th I thought the uh, barrel was going to explode, but it doesn't. And I still got plenty of water, so I guess, guess it's going to sh shoot some more. All right, here we go. One more time. Three in a row. And I'll I'll just shoot the other the other couple here. All right, there we go. I had six rounds in this one. All right, so these are the white box thirty-eight special, uh, nine hundred forty-five feet per second. Um. If, I, if I'm careful, I should be able to, to go grab that. <laughs> Blew the top off. Pretty cool. And guess what? I got two projectiles in here. Two projectiles. Look at that. So, I think this is just by the compression. I think the compression just exploded this. I can put the top back on. I'll see if there's a, a bullet hole in it. Uh, go this way, probably. Uh, boy. I think I shot a little low. You see a couple marks there. Uh, but, look at this. Here we go. There's one projectile. Here's the other one. They're pretty flat. These are the jacketed hollow points. Just let you guys know. All right. Here we go. There it is. A pretty mushroom. Pretty impressively here. Pretty cool. Pretty cool. So anyway, guys, just a quick little, uh, geez, a demonstration here on a 85 degree evening. And uh nice little project for a, a late evening uh, uh, little sh geez, shoot around. All right, guys, 460 style here. And uh, bring your kids, bring your family, bring everybody to the range. Keep it safe, keep it real. 460 style.